Hello, this is Mary Jones. And um, I'd just like to say that, um, well, being resident uh, in the wonderful Anna McCarrick has been just fundamental to my work. I've been going there since 1983, practically every year. Um, in fact, I would say like about 80% of, of my plays have started there or finished there. So it's been totally fundamental to the work that I do. But um, one play in particular I want to mention um, for Anna McCarrick, it's not just about the wonderful place and, 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 and the artists you meet and inspire you, but also the staff, the staff who make you feel like you're just in your own home. And, and one particular person I want to mention is Martina. Um, I'm sure anybody being there will know who Martina is. So when I was writing my play, Dear Arabella, because to me, she kind of personified the people I want to get to, the woman, the audience that I want to get to. So I would give her each section to take home her at night to read. And she come back the next day and go, I can't wait to hear what happens next. Well, I was just like music to my ears. So a year later, when I was again in Anna McCarrick and the play then had been commissioned to, um, to perform at the Lyric Theatre. And Martina, who herself was involved in amateur dramatics, asked me, could she perform the play uh, for, for a charity uh, do, in the, in the theatre in Monaghan? And I thought, oh, I can't really do this because it's not legal because, you know, the premiere is meant to be going on later on. But I thought, ah, the lyric can sue me. Even Martina deserves to do it. And I'm very, very glad that I, that she gave me that opportunity. And, and uh, I hopefully she's glad I give her the opportunity. So I'd like to present now Martina in a short excerpt from Dear Arabella. <laughs> 